This is the best opportunity for me to go back to school. We called the program Be Brave, so we're encouraging people to speak up and to offer their ideas and to be more confident. For some people, this is the first real training or comprehension of some of the stuff they did at school. She gave us the skills we needed, like just basics. On the line, we have to work out an average percentage of the height of a biscuit. Understand what they're counting to just give people some skills to, you know, just be better in life. I learned heaps from these schools. The email, I know how to use the computer now. The main things were communication and uh, understanding, um, listening and speaking up. I didn't really get a chance to get a good education so But doing this type of stuff, you know, sort of pushes you onto the next level. And they're also supporting people through um, mentoring, so I made sure there was people within my senior leadership team actually um, some one-on-one -on -one mentoring with the people that were going through the, um, the course as well, which was great. I had a crap childhood as well, and it just, like, yeah, he's brought himself up from where he's come from, and that's what I aspire to do as well. Like, I have watched people who have gone on to the cadet program and complete qualifications, and I've watched people grow in confidence. Since I've been here, I've managed to get my OSH Level 3 certificate, food and beverage Level 1, 2 and 3. I've also done a biscuit and cracker manufacturing association course. Taking them home, it's like I've got something to show my kids and my partners, like, look what I've done. This is where we're actually converting all this raw material into a finished product, and the more effectively we do that, which is through training, the faster that has an impact on the bottom line of the business. Some of the senior leaders in this business now have been blown away with the talent that we've got in our business, and the real desire that some of our people have to make things better for us. We've had ideas of people coming through and talking about making improvements to how we run the line or a better way to communicate. We've had a group put together an induction video where you can see how to swipe in, how to park, how to enter, where to go to change into your red line clothing. Put it together on the iMovie and, and there you go, it's, it's done and dusted. I had to make an information booklet as part of my project that I had to talk to um, HR, health and safety. Um, a lot of machine operators in the factory, line coordinators, which ha took me out of my shell. They're just like us. I've seen their projects implemented and for them it's a big buzz. Or it might be something simple like, hey, now I can use a computer and I don't have to get my son to do that for me anymore. As soon as they find out that uh, I'm doing this course, oh, good on you, mum. This is time for you to shine, mum. Congratulations, oh my gosh. Part of our strategy is to grow people and, and grow people from within, so this just helps get the best out of the staff we've got rather than going out and trying to find people. We've got them within our organisation now. Yeah, it made me feel like I shouldn't be afraid to put myself out there to reach my goals, to make my life better for me and my family. Because I didn't really have strong role models growing up and for my kids to be able to see me achieving these things, it, it really means a lot. This course is like a gold medal for me, honestly. Did everything in. Parenting, well, co-workers, probably a good person as well, you know? <laughs> Make you a better person. <laughs>